What's up, guys? It's SE Ambition. We're back here playing The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 2. And we're going to jump right into it. I think on the last episode we left off, I was walking toward a rock because we're trying to find, uh, I think his name's Pete. Um, so here we go. We're going to jump right back into this. Anyone see him? I'm supposed to be walking around this rock. Damn, he got fucking destroyed. Oh my god. Oh my god. What happened? What the hell happened? He's been shot. He's been shot. What the hell happened? He didn't have a gun. Who did this? Son of a bitch. We need to go. He's gone. Nick, he, he, he's gone. You gotta get moving. Come on, man. That was his dad, right? Or... I think so. Long live Pete. Tell me. Tell me how it happened. The last thing he said was, he wanted to say goodbye to you. Fuck. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? You... Sure, you still want to come with us? Look, I know we got off to a rough start. And I can't make any promises it won't get rougher, but we all know you now. We may not be perfect, but we look out for each other. Yeah, I'm with you guys. And we are glad to have you. Not everyone is. Well, they'll get there. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Ben. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. See anything? She better see something. We've been walking for a damn week. We've got to find some shelter. There's a lift or something. Chairlift? Must be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. Here, eat this back. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the night. Sounds like a good place to spend the night. Is that it? There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Passable? Good. I think so. Good. There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Hold on now. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. 
Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. She's a valuable little girl. I mean, hell, if she can sew up her own arm, she's fit to cross a bridge. I can do it. See? No problem. It's gonna be fine. Okay, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. I can go too. You stay with the group. I'm fine, Luke. I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. Damn, they're gonna need him later on. Sorry about that. He wanted to come. Really Something's gonna happen where right we go, we would need him. You're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? What does everyone want? Even the gangs. You know, what do you think they're all after? Safety? Close. Listen, what's the one thing a guy would walk hundreds of miles to get back? Family. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Anyways, you, you can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not gonna get in the middle of it. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? Seems like we're already in the middle of it. Tell me about it. There's only two of them, dude. You got your machete. Oh, that one doesn't have legs. Too much noise. Just go hit him with your machete. There are only two. I don't know. Well, what do you think? I think we can take him. I think we can take him. I'll take the big one. You get shorty. I'll take the big one. Wish we could use guns. We should be okay. I think. Got it. I'll take the small one. Good. Let's do it. Come free. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. Owned. Fucking wrecked. What am I supposed to do? Oh. Nice work, kid. Nice work. Ow. He just called her out. Yeah, I've done this before, remember? In a shed. Over the bridge. <clears throat> Come on. That one's pretty far back. We can kill these two and then... Kill those two. <gasps> oh shit! She said, oh shit. Hell yeah, Clem. Hurry. <gasps> Clementine, Jesus Christ. <gasps> Did I die? Yeah. 
I, I thought I pushed over on the deep or on the the stick, but I guess not. <clears throat> we'll try it again. This piece of shit. Did you drop your hammer? Did you just fuck it? <clears throat> I can't believe that she just dropped her damn hammer. Fuck. There, this is machete. Swing. What was I supposed to swing at? I was aiming and I didn't see the circle anywhere. Oh my damn! I suck! The hell is this? <coughs> Alright. <clears throat> We're gonna try this again. If I die this time, I'm gonna cry. Alright, come on. Oh yeah, I started right here. Okay, good. Why do you wait so long to hit? Oh, there we go. There's the circle. Ooh, right in her mouth. Got her ass. Ooh, yeah, there you go. Hurry up, Clem. No! <sighs> Jesus. Thanks, Clem. Let's keep going. You see him? Yeah. Yeah. Just play it cool. And you do the talking. What? Why me? I don't want to get in a fight. You really think he chewed a little girl? Just don't make any sudden moves. And don't piss him off. And don't tell him anything. What should I say? I don't know. Ask him for directions. Well, who are you? Well, who's asking? Who I am. Who's asking? I am. Wanna help me out here? We're a little lost. Help me out here? We're a little lost. Lost, huh? Lost, huh? Huh. What the you don't fuck is going like on? Assholes. Are you assholes? No offense or anything, but you know how it is out here. You run into a lot of assholes. I'm not an asshole. Oh, are you calling me an asshole? <laughs> you folks headed north like everyone else? Everyone else? I see at least one group a day move through here. They all look the same. It's like a great migration of the dazed and confused. Have you seen someone named Krista? Krista? Maybe. Really? No, I mean, a lot of people come through here. I don't know. I gotta say, you two look like shit. 
If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. Well, that's uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right then. Thank you. Hey, no problem. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got food and supplies back in the station. And if you want... What the fuck, man? What the hell is he doing? No, 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 who was that guy? Why didn't you wait for a signal? He was going to help us. How do you know? Damn it, Nick. I told you not to shoot. How was I supposed to hear you? You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go. Nick, you fucking dumbass! I got kind of looked like the guy from first episode, first season, the guy, Asian guy who like left. He kind of looked like him. <coughs> who the fuck was that back then? <coughs> I don't know. Looked like he had a gun on you. That <coughs> asshole drew on me. He was about to shoot. Oh, was he? I'm telling you, man, he drew first. Well, that's not what it looked like to me. Shut up, Nick. What did you see, Clem? Is that guy going to shoot? Fuck you, Luke. You've been on my case the whole week. And why do you think that is, Nick? He wasn't gonna do anything. I know what I saw. Either way, you could've hit one of us. Yeah, but I didn't. Look, I, I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but you can't- Don't fucking talk about him. You think he was with Carver? I don't know. I- No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge? We have to keep moving. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Luke, can I talk to you alone? What a hey, fucking Clem, bitch. You got anything to eat? Bet you're dying. I'm pissed off. I told you. Nick I'm fucking fine. shot him. Sorry, I'm out. I wonder if there's any way to save that guy. Yeah, me too. That. The man said he had food in the station. Mind checking it out? Maybe we could spend the night here. A little small for us, though. Sure. Thanks, Clem. Nah, I don't even want to talk to you. He gave me a talking symbol. Fuck no. I don't want to speak to you. I'm fucking pissed off he shot that guy. He made a good first impression. I liked him right away. I'm fucking done. What a fucking bitch. God damn it, Nick. I don't see a key around here. That man probably had it. Feels pretty good. Feels pretty good. <clears throat> Feels pretty good, what do you mean? It's a damn knife. It's dead. I guess he slept here. I guess he slept here. Where do I go? Is that all I'm supposed to look for? Oh.
Man, I thought we had a bed. Look at this dump. Guess he did have food. Man, fuck Nick. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. But that doesn't give him any excuse to start shooting up strangers. He's out of control. That's what I'm saying. He keeps on like that, he's going to get one of us killed. I mean, you ever know anyone to do a thing like that? Actually, yeah. What happened? A woman in our group. Her dad died, and then she just shot this other woman. Damn. What you do? We left her behind. Damn. Yeah, she shot Carly, my favorite fucking person. Carly is my favorite she of looks all just time. Like you. She just fucking bought. She like hey, Clem. There's she actually does look like her. Here, and Rebecca. Well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but... And I'd never go against the group. But I've got to put Beck and the baby first. Rebecca can have it. I won't say anything. Thanks, Clementine. It's a shame. Nick was a good guy. <coughs> He's still a good guy. He's just losing it. God knows we're not perfect. Hell, I'm glad you're with us, Clementine. The hell is that? Walkers. <coughs> we got oh shit. Yeah, <coughs> All right, we're heading up. All right. waiting for we have to be careful careful we've been on the road for five days my back is done being careful doesn't look like anybody's home damn nail down tight I'll check around front I'll go with you well it'd be good to know if anybody's actually back there Probably get a better view from up top. You'd have an easier time getting up there. You feel like taking a look? That'd be just like climbing a treehouse. Yeah, just a, a really tall treehouse. Well, what am I looking for? Anyone following us. How will we know it's them? We'll know. Just take it slow, and I'll catch you if you fall. Probably. Got a good grip? Yeah. When I was a kid, we used to jump rooftops downtown. Now that was fun. Well, that sounds stupid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. Whoa, 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 you're fine. You're fine. Just look at me, okay? You're, you're fine. All right, just, just slow down. Holy Score shit. Four second, okay? Score second, okay? Got your grip? I know I'm fine. Just trying to help. Yeah, I'm fine. That bird right next to me. Made it. Made it. You see anything? Really dark. Is that a car? Wait, I see something. What is it? A light. But wait, there's another. Luke. Luke.
Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Are you trying to rob us? Excuse me, honey, but do I look like a fucking thief? Everyone calm down. Hey, man, you calm the fuck down. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, fuck man. Fuck that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Please, just do what he says. Kenny! Holy shit. Wait, you know this guy? Clementine? I'll take that as a yes. These people with you? We can talk inside. Great. I just started dinner. Are you sure you don't mind? It's gonna storm soon. Please, come in. <coughs> Kenny. How did he live? I think guys are over like, oh, how did you not know? Well, I didn't watch a single thing on this because I still wanted to play it. <clears throat> how did he live? Kenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. Used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. And uh, believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. We tend to keep most of the lights off at night to avoid drawing attention. But after we found this stuff in storage, we couldn't resist making an exception. What's funny? Oh, nothing, Walt. Walter here's one smart some bitch. Makes a mean can of beans, too. Well, why don't you two catch up while I get some dinner started? Please, make yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. <coughs> the hell we will. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. Thanks. You're our guests here. There's no need to worry. Tell him to put his gun down then. Kenny? Will you vouch for these people, Clem? If you tell me they're good, then I'm Us. good. You were the one waving a gun around, man. We're cool, okay? Hey, hey, we're cool. We're cool. They're cool. They're cool. Dad, look. A Christmas tree. Not now, Sarah. Isn't it great? We found it all in storage. It's amazing. Good. If you'll all follow me, I'll show you where you can sleep. He lost his son and his daughter. I remember that now. Kenny. He lost his whole family. Still wearing this dirty old thing, huh? You know, I half expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to... It's just hard not to think about it, you know? He saved me. I knew it. I knew he would. That guy had a fire in him, sure as shit. He was a hell of a guy. When my son, well, he helped me do the right thing. I'll never forget that. So, where'd you end up? I was with Krista and Omid. 
Omid, well, Krista and I were together for a while. These guys caught us. She's gone. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. I'm sorry, darling. I wish I could have found you sooner. Where have you been? Oh, hell. All over after Savannah. How did you get out of there? For some reason, I tried to save that fucking shitbird, Ben. Then it turned into a damn cluster. Couldn't help the kid, but I got out. Long story short, I got lucky. Real lucky. Spent a long time alone after that. It, uh... And then I met Sarita, thank God. Gosh, it's great to have you back. You two catching up? Clem, this is my girl, Sarita. Ain't she beautiful? Nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, Walt, where's Matthew? He's still out there rooting around? Of course he is. Well, I'll start dinner. Carlos, right? Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Stay in sight, sweetie. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Sure. Clem, why don't you help Walt with dinner? Damn, dude, I can't believe we found Kenny. <coughs> hey, Clementine. Settling in well enough? Yeah, thanks. Excellent. Want to help me prepare a little dinner? So how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. Matthew and I barely knew what to do around here the first week. We're old friends. I met him after it happened. When he was with Lee? Yeah, he only told us a little. Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. Gosh, you remind me of my students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. Everyone underestimates me. I expect you've used that to your advantage. Sometimes. Smart girl. Mmm. Almost done. Would you do me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? What is this? Le Walter Surprise. An autumnal legume salad with a peach roux. It's peaches and beans. That's all we got. Huh. Striking resemblance. Anyway, I'll take it from here. He said it too. Ah, uh, that guy was with them and he's gonna find out. Aw, oh, shit. I bet you the guy <clears throat> that got shot on the bridge <clears throat> was with Kenny and all of them. They're going to find out, and that's going to start quite a bit of conflict. It's a concert, October 13th, Where do I go? Yo, fuck these lights. Isn't that just a face of terror? She looks like she's horrified. We could use some help. Here, Sarah, you take this and string them up over there. 
You knew Kenny before. It must be incredible to see him again. When I met him, well, he's so different now. But you must be so glad. Did he say anything about before? No. He won't talk about before I met him. Oh. Everything takes a little coaxing these days. Perfect. Now we just need the topper. We always had an angel on top of our tree. My family didn't celebrate Christmas, but I still love the decorations. I remember he was saying he tried to save Ben. Kenny did. And he said, everyone hated Ben. I never mind. Like, I get he was kind of a fucking idiot, but I liked Ben. They might be tracking us. I don't know why. What do you think they are? Ninjas? Clem, Luke said you saw some people in the valley. People? Way down there. How? She's got binoculars, genius. I saw lights. Which way did they go? Back into the woods. We cannot take any chances. We leave at dawn. But we're safe here for tonight, right? Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? We have to be careful. He mentioned someone else. Someone else? Who? His friend. His name is Matthew. Look, I don't care what that man said. We're staying here tonight. Just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. Matthew is probably the guy down on the bridge that fucking Nick I'm, shot. I don't feel so good. Beck, what's wrong? I just need something to drink. You got it. I'll be right back. I guess. Beautiful. Uh, I used to love this time of year. You know, now that your friends are here, this place is starting to feel like a real home. Matthew and Walter are amazing people. Honestly, it's dangerous to be this kind, but they can't help it. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. What does Matthew look like? Oh, he's a handsome man. Little shorter than Walter. He should be back soon. Clem, I wanted to ask you. I fucking knew does it. Can he seem different to you? I didn't know. Matthew's the guy that we fucking shot on the bridge. He has God damn it! Bad days like everyone else. But lately, I get the feeling he's struggling. I haven't noticed. Oh, well, let me know if you do. Well, you three have been busy. Kenny. Isn't it great? I got it, huh? I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. I said I got it. Always has to play the gentleman. But I'll tell you, when I met him, he couldn't lift a fly. Why don't you go see if your friends are ready for dinner, Clementine? go I forgot what she said go check on what I can't figure out where to go. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. <clears throat> I have a lighter. Let's light the Christmas tree on fire. 
<sighs> Just fucking torch it. Ah. Uh, I think I'm gonna end this episode right about here, though, guys. This actually has been a pretty long episode. Uh, so, if you enjoyed the video, then leave a like rating below. If you want to see videos whenever I release them, you can hit the subscribe button, and they will go straight into your subscription box whenever I upload. See you later, guys. I'm SC Ambition. Ready, aim, fire.